Hi, this video is about a small, little, unassuming bulb with amazing healing properties. It's beyond cheap and you probably already got it at home. It's garlic. Garlic is antiviral, antibacterial, antifungal, antiparasitic and anti-blood clotting and it has antibiotic activity and it's also been found to fight MSRA, the superbug, quite efficiently. It's immune boosting, it's really good for the gut flora, it helps you digest fats more efficient and um, it keeps cholesterol down. Uh, also, if you've got high blood pressure, it pushes it down, but if your blood pressure is too low, it can raise it slightly. Um, it's really good if you've got allergies like hay fever because it has um, antihistamine properties in there. Uh, it's also really good if you've got phlegm, it loosens the phlegm, so if you have a really bad cough that you've been, ha that you've been having for a long time or you've got whooping cough or asthma, anything that you need to loosen the phlegm and just get it, the whole thing moving, it's really good for that. And it may also protect against certain cancers. So it's a pretty powerful little bulb, this. So garlic contains something called aline. And when you chop it or crush it or, or just smash it, it comes in contact with an enzyme called alinease. And that creates a smelly substance called alicine. And alicine is the magic of garlic. And it's very unstable, so as soon as you've chopped it up, you need to eat it straight away if you eat garlic for medicinal purposes. Uh, because alicine destroys really, really quickly. Within an hour, some people say, it's, it's mostly all gone. So you need to eat it quite quickly. And if you, if you fry it or cook it or leave it for a long time, it will all disappear. So I take one or two garlic cloves a day, most days. I chop them up really, really, really finely in small little, small cubes so I get all that smelly, garlicky allicine going. And, and I put it straight back and then I just drink some water. And um, I also give it to the kids. My five-year-old likes the taste. Uh, my nine-year-old is not that impressed. But then he has hay fever, so because of its uh, antihistamine activity in there, I'm quite keen on him to, uh, to eat it. So I give them half a chopped up, super, super finely cubed up um, garlic clove each, half each. And then they just hold their nose, put it straight back and just drink juice and that seems to be fine. Uh, I also recommend taking one or two cloves before you go on a flight because of its anti-blood clotting activities and also because, you know, to fight colds and flus and whatnot that's flying around in an aeroplane. Um, I think that's very good. And also, who knows, I mean, some people might say you smell a little bit of garlic and they ask to move the person sitting next to you and hey presto, you've got an extra seat. Actually, I don't think it smells that much. I've been taking them for a long time and I've also taken the, the capsules. I don't think they smell that much. I all, almost think the capsules smell more, I don't know. It's just another type of smell. I think um, this is fresh, it's cheap and why mess with perfection? I absolutely think this is the best way of taking garlic because you don't know. I mean, obviously you go to a brand that's well-renowned, you know, but you don't know. Here you will know that it is fresh and it's chopped up by you and it hasn't been waiting on a, anywhere on a bench anywhere, you know, you know it's fresh stuff. So that is the healing magic of garlic. I hope that was helpful and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.